Good morning, you welcome to True Events, and the headlines are Governors Wiki asked by Serap to disclose the details of Chinese loans. Nigerians call for the prosecution of Canada-based Nigerian over violent remark. Cristiano Ronaldo awarded all-time highest goal scorer in UEFA 2024-2025 Champions League. Wayne Jota celebrates sign-out from the University of Lagos. <laughs> Governors Wiki asked by Serap to disclose the details of Chinese loans. The 36 state governors and the minister of the Federal Capital Territory, Abuja, Yen Wiki, have been asked by the Social Economic Rights and Accountability Project, SERA, to disclose the details of Chinese loans, liabilities, and other external borrowing obtained and guaranteed by the federal government. SERA has urged all governors to clarify any investment agreements with Chinese companies alongside the history of repayment of any such loans, liabilities, and facilities obtained from China and external creditors. According to Serap, the non-accountability mechanisms for the Chinese loans may expose Nigerians' assets in foreign jurisdictions to confiscation. Nigerians call for the prosecution of Canada-based Nigerian women for violent remarks. Nigerians via the internet have called for the arrest and prosecution of Canada-based Nigerian Amaka Patience Sunbeger for her outrageous comments threatening to kill the Yorubas and the Benin by poisoning their food and their water. In a video on TikTok, mm -hmm. she was heard saying in Pigeon, record me very well. It's time to start poisoning the Yoruba and the Benin. Put poison in all your food at work. Put poison in your water so that you all die one by one. Enough is enough. Although she has deleted her TikTok account, the Director General of the Nigerians in the Diaspora Commission, Abike Dabiri Erewa, has identified the said woman while revealing that several Nigerians in the diaspora have officially reported her a Maka patient son beggar to the relevant Canadian authorities. Cristiano Ronaldo awarded all time highest goal scorer in UEFA 2024 2025 Champions League. 39-year-old Cristiano Ronaldo on Thursday, 29th of August, received an award from UEFA for highest goal scorer in the UEFA Champions League during the live draw for the 2024-2025 Champions League. The Stars' goal record holds an incredible total of 140 goals in 183 Champions League games through his career in Manchester United, Real Madrid and Juventus. Recall that UEFA has earlier announced some major changes to the format of the Champions League draw to strengthen the synergy between the league and the knockout phases. Cristiano Ronaldo's record-breaking status continues to solidify his status as one of the all-time greatest footballers while also serving as an inspiration to the younger generation to chase their dreams with diligence, hard work and focus. Dwayne Jartel celebrates sign out from the University of Lagos. Chukwebuka Emmanuel Amuze, also known as Green Jutter, has on August 25th celebrated his sign out from the University of Lagos, where he read and studied business administration. Alongside other classmates of his, Green Jutter could be seen popping a bottle of wine and singing the famous Mike Ejaga's Gogo Gwangwa song amidst the celebration. <laughs> How he was able to combine the busy lifestyle of a big entertainer into this world and the studious lifestyle of an undergraduate commands applause. We have come to the end of true events. See you next Saturday.